Other news tonight, another violent weekend in Wichita with more than half a dozen shootings, two of them deadly. One of the victims, just a teenager at a graduation party. Today, city leaders and community activists spoke out about the violence, demanding change. Want to bring in KS and Sam Montero. She was there for this news conference today and she joins us live with their message tonight. Sam. Emily, the community as well as WPD are still reeling from this weekend's deadly shootings. The main concern, more and more of these incidents are involving the city's youth. The press conference was a call for help from the police. The amount of officers that we have on the streets can't withstand that type of violence, that type of incidents, so those type of incidents occurring in our city without affecting response times. To community leaders. A few years ago, we were all up in arms about police killing. Now is our children killing one another and it has to stop. Together they want to see change. The, the violence and the, the things that are happening with our juveniles, it needs to be addressed and not through words, not through meetings, but through actions. Most of police officers, they care about this neighborhood. We need them. We need the police department. They're not out here to hurt them. They come by, they wave, they speak. I mean, I don't understand it. And we need to teach our children to respect them. And we have to respect them. They all have the same goal. Which one of us wants to be the one at Wesley with the pastor and the doctor having to pull the plug? None of us. None of us want our children to die on these streets and no one say anything and no one do anything. If you know something, say something. Interim Chief Lem Moore says his goal before he leaves this role at the department is to get more police policing the streets of Wichita. Here for you in Wichita, San Montero, KSN News 3.